Welcome to Hydrohaven's comprehensive guide on plants that bring life back to depleted earth. Whether you're battling compacted clay, nutrient-stripped ground, or soil damaged by chemicals, these botanical healers can transform your garden's foundation. As fellow soil enthusiasts, we've gathered decades of collective gardening wisdom into this resource, focusing on plants that not only survive in challenging conditions, but actively repair and revitalize the ground beneath them. Before diving into our plant heroes, let's quickly understand what dead soil actually means. Healthy soil teems with billions of microorganisms, contains balanced nutrients, and supports complex ecosystems. Dead soil lacks this biological activity, structure, and nutrient cycling ability. Common causes include chemical overuse, erosion, compaction, and monoculture farming. The plants in this guide specifically target these issues through various mechanisms, deep taproot systems that break compaction, nitrogen fixation abilities, carbon sequestration, microbial relationship building, organic matter production, and erosion control. Now let's explore the remarkable plants that can transform your barren ground into a living, thriving ecosystem. White clover transforms atmospheric nitrogen into soil-available forms through symbiotic relationships with rhizobia bacteria. This perennial ground cover produces extensive root systems while tolerating poor conditions. Its shallow but dense roots prevent erosion while gradually building topsoil. Plant white clover as a living mulch around vegetables or fruit trees, or use it to revitalize patches of dead lawn. Red clover delivers deeper soil penetration than its white cousin, with taproots extending 2 to 3 feet underground. This biennial or short-lived perennial excels at breaking compaction while fixing impressive amounts of nitrogen up to 150 pounds per acre annually. Its abundant biomass makes it perfect for chop and drop mulching, or as a green manure crop, returning valuable organic matter when incorporated into soil. The champion of deep-rooted nitrogen fixers, alfalfa's impressive tap roots can penetrate 20 plus feet into subsoil, breaking through hard pan and accessing nutrients and water unavailable to most plants. Beyond nitrogen, alfalfa mines calcium, magnesium, iron, and other minerals from deep soil layers. This perennial legume thrives in poor soils with minimal care, gradually transforming them into fertile ground through its extensive root decay and renewal cycle. For severely damaged landscapes requiring long-term remediation, black locust trees provide unmatched soil healing capabilities. These fast-growing nitrogen fixers create microclimates beneath their dappled shade while continuously depositing nitrogen-rich leaf litter. Their extensive root systems prevent erosion on even steep slopes. While considered invasive in some regions, strategically planted black locusts can jumpstart forest succession on devastated lands. This nitrogen-fixing shrub thrives in the harshest conditions, from drought-prone slopes to nearly sterile mining spoils. Beyond nitrogen fixation, autumn olive produces berries that attract birds, accelerating seed dispersal of other beneficial plants throughout your landscape. Its extensive root system prevents erosion while building soil organic matter. Note, check local regulations as it's considered invasive in some regions. This annual legume excels as a winter cover crop, protecting bare soil through cold months while fixing nitrogen. Its deep roots loosen compacted layers, and when terminated in spring, it releases a slow-feed nitrogen supply perfectly timed for summer crops. Vetch's sprawling growth also smothers weeds, reducing competition for your primary plants. Perhaps the ultimate permaculture plant for soil regeneration, Comfrey's deep tap roots mine subsoil nutrients unavailable to most plants. Its rapidly produced, mineral-rich leaves make excellent mulch, compost activator, or liquid fertilizer when steeped in water. Plant Comfrey strategically around fruit trees or at garden edges for continual soil improvement through chop-and-drop harvesting. These biodrills penetrate compacted soil with tap roots that can grow 1 to 2 inches in diameter and extend several feet deep. When winter killed, these massive roots decompose, leaving channels for water, air, and beneficial organisms to penetrate previously impenetrable layers. Their rapid decomposition also releases captured nutrients and adds organic matter deep within the soil profile. With bitter leaves and stunning blue flowers, chicory's agricultural value lies in its drought-resistant taproot system that breaks through compacted soil layers. These roots access deep water and mineral reserves, supporting the plant through extreme conditions while gradually improving soil structure. Chicory works exceptionally well in pasture renovation mixes, supporting livestock while healing the land. 
This medicinal powerhouse serves equally well as a soil healer. Yarrow's extensive root system improves soil structure while accumulating phosphorus, potassium, and copper. Its ferny foliage provides excellent biomass for mulching, and its flowers attract beneficial insects that contribute to soil health through predation and pollination services. Native to North American prairies, switchgrass develops massive root systems extending more than 10 feet into the soil, breaking compaction while building carbon reserves. These perennial grasses thrive with minimal care in poor conditions, gradually transforming depleted soils through annual root turnover and organic matter deposition. Their above-ground biomass can be harvested for mulch or left standing for wildlife habitat. The king of prairie grasses creates similarly impressive underground ecosystems with roots extending 8 to 12 feet deep. These extensive root systems host beneficial fungi and bacteria that rebuild soil food webs in damaged environments. Big blue stem's tolerance for both drought and periodic flooding makes it ideal for stabilizing problematic areas with variable moisture conditions. Another prairie native, Indian grass complements other native grasses with slightly different growth habits and root structures. Its extensive fibrous roots excel at holding soil particles together, preventing erosion while creating habitat for beneficial soil organisms. Plant in diverse mixes with other native grasses and forbs for maximum soil regeneration benefits. For severe erosion control and soil stabilization, few plants match vetiver grass. Its massive, vertical root system can reach 10 to 15 feet deep within two years, creating living barriers against soil loss while gradually improving soil structure and fertility. Unlike many grasses, vetiver doesn't spread horizontally, staying exactly where planted while performing its soil healing magic. This tough nitrogen-fixing shrub thrives in the harshest conditions, from drought to poor alkaline soils. Beyond improving soil fertility, it produces edible pea pods and creates valuable wildlife habitat. Its extensive root system prevents erosion while building soil organic matter through leaf litter and root turnover. This nitrogen-fixing shrub tolerates salt-contaminated soils, making it ideal for coastal areas or roadside plantings affected by de-icing salts. Its extensive root system stabilizes slopes, while its berries attract wildlife that contribute to soil fertility through nutrient cycling. Sea buckthorn's silvery foliage also reduces water loss in hot, exposed areas. These nitrogen-fixing trees specialize in colonizing wet, disturbed areas, making them perfect for streambank restoration or healing waterlogged sites. Their relationship with Frankia bacteria allows them to fix atmospheric nitrogen while their roots prevent erosion. Fallen alder leaves decompose quickly, rapidly building soil organic matter. Transforming dead soil into living earth is one of gardening's most rewarding experiences. Start small, observe carefully, and allow these plant allies to work their magic. Document your progress with soil tests and photographs to celebrate each improvement. If you found value in this guide, please subscribe to the Hydrohaven YouTube channel for more in-depth gardening content. Share this resource with fellow gardeners working to heal their own patches of earth. Together, we're not just growing plants, we're rebuilding the foundation of life itself, one garden at a time. Remember, every damaged landscape holds the potential for remarkable recovery. Your efforts to heal the soil extend far beyond your garden boundaries, supporting watershed health, carbon sequestration, and biodiversity. Happy planting!